Hi everyone, good morning, I'm Marcy Gonzalez. And I'm TJ Holmes with the top stories on this Thursday, May 14th. We begin with the focus on speed as investigators look for answers after that deadly Amtrak crash in Philadelphia. We now know that the train was going over 100 miles an hour in a 50 mile an hour zone when all seven cars jumped the tracks. Engineer now says he doesn't remember a thing about the crash. An American is among the five people killed in an attack on a guest house in Kabul, Afghanistan. The U.S. Embassy in Kabul did not provide information about the American. A police say gunmen stormed the guest house as it hosted a party for foreigners, and the Taliban has now claimed responsibility. A heavy rain that's been drenching much of Texas is causing widespread flooding, causing scenes like this one. All that rain making drivers driving dangerous. Flash flood picked up this car, swept it away. Driver managed to get out of there. Forecasters predict more rain in Texas today. And a scary scene on an interstate in Louisiana caught by a dash camera inside a tractor trailer. You see that RV towing a pickup truck come alongside and then the motorhome veers into the median and rolls over. The front driver's side tire blew out causing the accident. No one was seriously hurt and police say a cable barrier in the median kept the RV uh, from oncoming traffic. All right, you can get more news anytime at ABCnews.com. I'm Marcy Gonzalez. And I'm TJ Holmes. Thanks for watching.